Hi there, Blaze here. Welcome on Monday. Sunday was my day off because of party I attended. The only thing I done yesterday was check enemy basic logic milestone on Space Strike to-do list and create new one for making enemies a real opponent. And this is small milestone for this week, but I hope it won't be the only task I will do. Okay, it's time to start real programming. To fight with enemy, it should have component for managing health. On defeat, it should give player some points and destroy self. Enemy should also give damage when collides with player and should shoot some missiles to player's direction. Hello, welcome on Tuesday. I just finished my shooting system for enemies. As you can see, they shoot missiles to player's direction and screen movement is also absorbed. Because without this, missiles targets position behind player. When player collides with missile, it loses health, but for now there is no event on reaching 0 HP. Player also can shoot missiles. After collide with enemy, it instantly despawns. I will add destroying animation in the future. I've also changed player's prefab. Removed controlled object and make it simply player. This could be done because camera now also have script I created in last days for constantly move forward. This is little more intuitive to have camera not related with player object. With this week I also started to creating something I can call soundtrack for my game. I don't have any experience on creating music and on playing also. I just play a few times on drums when I was younger and love to listen. I listen almost all the day. Therefore I decided to create music on my own because I want to learn something new. Because art tasks are not related with milestones in my project management system, I don't have any deadlines, so I will just inform you about process in next devlogs. This month my Apple Watch challenged me to close all the rings for 80 times in month. And this is really challenging because I have my rings set to more calories than it was by default, but I decided to approve this challenge. As you can see, I have it done 7 times by now and I wanna have this week a 7 day strike. So as you can see, Monday and Tuesday are done. We will see how about the rest of the week. Everyone welcome in Wednesday evening. Today I clean up my code after enemy movement system update and this is the last task from this milestone. Tomorrow we will start milestone number 4. So to make this possible, I also checked done task on my to-do list, move to-do comments from code into this list and set up new milestone. As you can see, I use Apple Reminders for a few days instead of Notion. This is because I test something to record related video in the future. But now I gonna sleep. Good night and see you tomorrow. Oh, quick update yet? I have also reached all my activity goals today. Welcome on Thursday morning. It's about 6 am and it's time to start creating score system. I'm a little bit surprised, but I finished this in one hour. I created score system script, which use mostly static fields and attach it to every object that make use of scores. At the moment it is added only to enemies and enemy scripts set higher score after killing it. Scores are currently locked into console and as you can see we have 4 enemies on screen but get only 30 points. This is because after killing the last enemy we destroy last instance of score system script so it doesn't print score into console anymore. But that's okay, because we want always to have at least one instance of it, for example on score counter UI, which I gonna create in next days. I think that after adding this instance to UI, we could remove this script from enemies, because setting score is also done by static function, but I will leave it as it is by now. 
It's Saturday now, the last day of this devlog, and I wanna summarize entire week and finish milestone with UI. So I implemented shooting system to enemies and make them possible to defeat. Also implemented score system, which count points on every defeated enemy, make a little on pixel arts and music. And the last thing is still undone, UI. Implementation of score counter was super easy and fast. I get most from my prototype, but when it comes to health bar, I have an idea to make more general class of progress bar and use it in different cases. After writing code for a few hours, I have working, but not ideal system for this, but then I think about principle named YAGNI. And this stands for you aren't gonna need it. And exactly, I probably won't use progress bars in more cases than health bar for player or enemies. So I just made a reference to health component. And that's all for today. I'm happy with what I done this week. Future week will probably be the worst because I need to create enemies on the entire map, but I don't have an idea for this. I will think about it tomorrow. At the end, as you can see, I reached my fitness goal for every day but Sunday, which is tomorrow. So after releasing this video, I hope I will get this. Hit the thumbs up if you like this video, because I'm very poor when it comes to likes on this channel. Subscribe for more game dev content and see you soon. Bye.